someday. Prince. Pretty soon, you got chaos. Is that what you want? Tell me he's charming. You really can't handle the suspense. <laughs> no, I can't. Just tell me what he does. Take a guess. Oh, if I guess right, you promise to tell me. Scout's honor. Okay, he's a lawyer. Nope. And an astronaut. Strike two. Oh, <gasps> does he play center for the Bulls? You really have no idea. Maybe I did lose my magic. Andy's an accountant. Andy? Yes, your date does have a name. And it's Andy. What about this isn't clicking for you? Well, the part with Andy, the accountant. Andy's a great guy and a great accountant. I guess I'll just have to take your word for it. You won't have to. You'll see us tomorrow night at Grey House. Am I as strong as an ox? <laughs> More like a chipmunk. Oh, I have no place to go but up. OK, push your palm against mine. Good. I'm going to push back, and I want you to resist as best you can. Mm-hmm. I know. Chipmunk. Actually, you are stronger than the last time. Seriously? Seriously. Actually, seems pretty rough. Now I know how they must have felt with no internet. Oh, yeah, it was totally my first thought, too. Hey, what are you doing tomorrow night? You asking me out? I am. I have got the perfect guy for you. What's his name? I'll do a search. When I get back to LA, because I can't search for him here. You're leaving. Waiting for a cab. OK, but you're going to be missing out. If this guy's that perfect, why don't you go out with him? Oh, <laughs> we work together. It would be weird. I like weird. Then you're gonna love Carter. Okay, he's not totally weird, but trust me, he is worth sticking around for. Carter, huh? Yoo-hoo! All my V-volunteurs, report to the dining room. I gotta go rehearse for the tableau, but can I count on you? I'm in. Great. All eyes will be drawn here. Sorry I'm late. Don't be. It's been scintillating. As I was saying, this will be the center, the nucleus, if you will, of our recreation. But the ancillary characters will still play a vital role. All brought together, it will be a production to remember. We are just standing still for 60 seconds, right? It's not as easy as it sounds. It is, if you follow a technique practiced by mimes worldwide. Allow me to demonstrate. You walk, and then you simply freeze. That's the technique. It allows you to stay in a more natural pose than if you just tried to freeze. Those moms really know what they're talking about. Oh, flower shipments 45 minutes early. Oh, darn. I hate to leave rehearsal. I'll send you a detailed video to be studied at length. <sighs> hey. You guys still at it? Well, the plot just thickened. I am only here to talk to Cassie about a menu change for tomorrow night. Oh, sort of how you changed your mind about my greenhouse status. This would probably be a good time for everyone to take five. That's our cue. Except for you two. Good, maybe Cassie can help you see the error of your ways. You vetoed my paint color. You blocked me in the greenhouse. <sighs> would, would you, you tell, tell her, her I'm right? right? Well, maybe you're both right. I don't believe that's possible. Hmm. Sounds to me like you don't believe in compromise. <laughs> well, she's got you there. I am the queen of compromise. You're not the only one who can compromise. Well, look at that. You're both in agreement. Well, I suppose I could permit Stephanie's mustard-colored house paint if she would carve me out a plot. And I would be happy to carve you out one, if I could. If you could. I gave them all out. Well, then, consider my offer rescinded. <sighs> Do 
shoddy. Hello, Abigail. Guessing you're not here for flowers. I can be. I can also be here for you. Thought you'd be dancing in the streets by now. Well, nothing breaks a mother's heart more than seeing her child in pain. I wish he wasn't. I wish you weren't either. It may be cliche to say love conquers all, but I do believe it's rooted in the truth. Truth is it can't conquer the curse. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> we are. <laughs> I do sound like you, don't I? And I sound like you. We're more alike than you care to admit. Way to kick a girl when she's down. <laughs> well, anyone who makes my son as happy as you can't be all bad. Truth is, I have grown quite fond of you, Abigail. You're not making this any easier. Good. I fought hard to keep you two apart. But now I'm gonna fight even harder to keep you two together. Cassie, I... I'm sorry, is that bull singing? It's a Tibetan singing bowl. Well, it has a lovely voice. Yeah, it's used for meditating. You feel the sound as much as you take it in with your ears. Any chance I could take in that cloak you set aside? Right over there. <gasps> it's identical to the one in the painting. Isn't that the point? The point is, I should have tasked you with finding all the props in my list. I'm happy to help with anything else. I think I've collected almost everything we need to help bring Nathaniel Merowick's vision to life. I even found an old deed in the archives that looks perfect. Mm -hmm. But you can't find any Heather. But I can't find any... Oh, honestly. Heather is out of season. Well, nothing's out of season in a greenhouse. No, normally you're spot on, but our greenhouse is only two days old. You'd be amazed at what can spring up in two days. Really? You rang? You ready for round two? <laughs> Take a shot. Let's see what you got. All right. I said take a shot. <laughs> Come on. I know. It wasn't pretty. It worked. And it'll work even better tomorrow. I have no doubt. Tricina. Chrysanthemums, strobilanthes. Oh, Heather! Excuse me, kind citizen. Not what I thought you'd be calling me. Oh, it's you. Let's not do this again, Martha. I don't have time to do this again. I have to find Heather that isn't yours, if I can find my way around your spacious plot. How much do you need? Are you offering? It is a community garden. It's meant for sharing. And I can't think of anyone that I would rather give flowers to right now. I wish there was a way I could make up this old greenhouse thing to you. Perhaps there is. That woman was my old softball coach. You don't tell me you played center field, third base. I was all county. Impressive. You know, a new survey from the Loring Research Center ascertained softball participation has an annual growth of 6.5%. And he's like a walking search engine. <laughs> That's hilarious. 
Some people think I have a dry sense of humor. No, I didn't say dry. I said no sense of humor. That's hilarious. You want to get a drink? I could go for a beer. Bottle or can? Please. Bottle. Bottle. <laughs> so, um, Carter tells me you're an accountant. Actually, I prefer a diagnostic statistician. Oh. In my line of work, we have to be precise. <laughs> makes it sound more expensive. <laughs> and you? Carter says you renovate houses? Oh, I prefer domicile rejuvenation. Impressive. It is. What are you working on now? Mm, we are restoring one of Middleton's most historic. Domicile? You're quick. <laughs> <laughs> and accurate. I was named Middleton's top CPA three of the last seven years. If you're looking at monetizing depreciation, I'm your man. Oh, to let my friends know at tax time. Great. I'll give you a few dozen business cards. No, I... <laughs> Makeup? Everyone else is on stage, warming up. That's Joy. I know. I'm late. I was on a date. More like a date disaster. Ooh, do tell. Don't tell. Go get in your wardrobe. We'll do your hair and makeup when you're dressed. It will take me two seconds. You've got one. <sighs> That's five out of six actors now accounted for. Still no Nick? Mm, not a word. But as his understudy, I'm fully prepared to take on the role. Oh, no, 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 no. Performers only. What's wrong? I'll give you both a minute. Just tell me. I found out more about the Colony family. And? And there are none left. I'm so sorry to interrupt, but I just discovered that Nick has been stuck on the runway with no cell service for two hours. Why are you telling us? Because Donovan is the perfect replacement. I thought you were the understudy. Well, I would be. Phenomenal. It did occur to me that having a gentleman in the role would be more accurate. I'll pass. You should do it. It'll be the last time we're together. Well, that's anachronistic. I need a stagehand. Stat. Strike that. Away, people. Line up and prepare to make your entrance. Oh, everyone break a leg. Is anybody else nervous? All the great ones get nervous. Yes, I do. Silencio. The curtain is about to part. Looks a lot like your family crest. Shh. Oh, switcheroo. Ah, uh, walking stick in your right, hold the gate in your left. Hurry. What? You're up. Go, 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 go. Get this deed. The archives. I just grabbed any old one. This is a deed from Roderick Davenport to Priscilla Connolly. Wait, so you're Roderick? And you're Priscilla. Why would Roderick and Priscilla be in Nathaniel Merriwick's painting? It's got to be another clue. 
This means that Roderick gave the Traveler a piece of his land. It was payment to Priscilla for helping him cast the curse. There may not be any Connollys left. But now we can go check and see if they left anything behind. <laughs> 